Yes, this is Walter Lee Hill, your UniversalSoulPower.com, this UniversalSoulPower.com, the new rhythm and bluesy contemporary hip-hop soul. I want to do a two-minute drill today and basically talk about a topic. The topic is the narcissism of the contemporary athlete. Um, Dr. J uh, was the predecessor to Michael Jordan and the, the uh, Kobe Bryant and LeBron James that you see today. And basically this self-indulgent narcissism, I believe, started with him because he was the first popular athlete to uh, get it major endorsement deals. And um, his narcissism was so uh, great that he had a child out of wedlock, Andrea Stevenson, the uh, tennis player. And basically, uh, she went to see him when she was a little girl. Mom took her. He was doing a basketball camp, and he didn't even acknowledge her. Of course, she was very upset about this. But this narcissistic attitude is what you see from the uh, athletes that I talked about, including uh, Michael Jordan, LeBron James, Kobe Bryant. And this attitude is one whereby these guys lack a uh, black social consciousness, they don't care about the black community. And the concept drawn out um, applies to them. And that's basically, they were superstars in AAU basketball, into college, they were adored, uh, told stay away, stay out of trouble, stay away from the black students. And then on into the pros, uh, they were managed by agents. They served their uh, masters, the owners, the uh, commissioner of the NBA. And uh, this particular issue is something that is very important because uh, with the black community being in the state that it's in, these guys could help out. So that's my diatribe on the uh, narcissism of the contemporary black athlete. This is Walter Lee Hillier, UniversalSoulPower.com. Check out the blog. There's some great articles on politics, sports, and a lot of different issues. Later.